funnily enough, I actually did bring something. Oh. So. Wow. I'm scared. First off. Like us in like a takeaway thing. <laughs> no! <laughs> yeah! No! <laughs> Belle Delphine arrested for selling bath water. No. No, but I did get into a little bit of a sticky, like a legal thing. Because basically when I sold it, I didn't put any disclaimer on the website and I didn't put any disclaimer on the packaging. So what I had to do was I had to re-email everyone who bought it and say like, you need to sign this before I can send it to you. So it took so oh, long and it was such a bore. But I mean, I did it and most people replied back mm. and then I was covered. But I, I just forgot to put that disclaimer. And apparently that disclaimer is very important because someone in America could drink it and be like, this, you know, made me sick. And then they could sue me. Why um, specifically in America? Because suing is a thing there. Huh? Suing is a thing. Oh, there. right. Oh, I thought you... Oh, okay. I get it. Yeah. It's normally like, oh, I'll get my lawyer on you or something <laughs> right. like that. They've all got lawyers, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't really get that in England. Yeah. Can you just give us the top line about what, what you did? Like, I know we've just alluded to it, but you sold... You literally sold your bath water, didn't you? <laughs> well, funnily enough, I actually did bring something. Oh. So... Wow. Open I'm scared. Oh, so it's, it's it. First off, like us in like a takeaway thing. <laughs> no! <laughs> yes! No! Yes! <laughs> we, for anyone listening on Spotify, we it's, it's, it's the famous butt plug fidget spinner. Yeah. Did you make that yourself? Yes. Oh my That's god! That's ridiculous. Thank you so much. So uh, I'll uh. Can I? I'll is, is, is that's a new yeah, one? Is that a new one? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll place it in the box afterwards. Okay. Can't wait to use that with you, Jack. <laughs> and then I have got some. Oh, original. amazing. So this is old because this is from the same time. So we shouldn't drink it now. But um, you can see loads of particles flying in it. That's just and dead not, skin, don't worry. Yeah, probably some foot in there. Some uh, oh, toenails. Oh, let me have a look. Them. Thank you. That is ridiculous. What do you think this is? Dead, dead skin. Well, I have it's no idea likely what it to is. be, isn't it? I've, I've just completed life. I've got some Belle Delphine Gamer Girl bath water, and, and I mean, like that's legitimate bath water, isn't it? Yes. I yeah. like the packaging. Yeah. Did you make you. this packaging? <laughs> no, but I did buy it because that it was is good. nice. Yeah. Can, can I keep this? Yes, of course. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, not sure what I'll do with the butt plug fin fidget spinner. <laughs> <laughs> I know what we'll do with it, Jack. Don't worry. <laughs> Fiona, we're in for a good night tonight. Uh, that's not. What me. is she filming us? <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> you started this. The thing is. When I told my friends you were coming on, they were all like, "You've got to ask her about the butt plug fidget spinner." <laughs> so I, if I'm, if I, can I? Keep... I didn't even know about that. So the chance of me actually that is ridiculous. Yeah. That, yeah, yeah, that is a bit. That is a bit a, yeah. a big thing. I love um, that it spins even um, there. I'm gonna. What well, I can keep that as well. What this? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, I'm gonna. That's gonna be in my videos in some way. I don't know. Or Tr trade it with Will and E. <laughs> oh no! I'm gonna, no no no! I'd rather have that than the car. <laughs> So fucking weird. Now, Belle, you kindly gave us your your bath water original. Um, amazing. Thank you for that. Now, Be careful, the lid's coming off. Now, okay. So I haven't put the lid on properly. Now, well, one of our friends, uh, uh, dear friends, and, and friend of the podcast, and YouTuber Spencer Owen, creator of the Wembley Cup, um, a whole array of other things. He, t I told him that you were coming on the same day that he was here. He was here this morning, and uh, I didn't know he was going to do this, but he brought a gift to give to you. <laughs> That is amazing. <laughs> and he described this. Uh, well, we, all we can do is describe it as what he's told us it is. He he said it's toilet water. His He said that he doesn't bathe. He only showers. Oh. Um, so he couldn't get water the same way you did. So instead, mm -hmm. he decided to give you toilet water, which is a little bit yellow. There you go. There's um, there's some toilet water from Spencer Owen. Thank um, you. Wow. <laughs> I shall uh, put this right next to my bed so I can see it every morning <laughs> when I wake up. Do you, do you want to give it a smell? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Straight away. Yes. Yeah. Straight away. I thought, I thought you'd never ask. What's it smell like? 
Hmm. There's no disclaimer on that. Smells we could get like in a lot a of trouble. Yeah. BLT. <laughs> <laughs> uh, again, just going back to cold ones because it is a, a great interview and we can't claim to be the first person to ask you this. Um, I'm sure you've spoken about it all the time, but can you confirm, Belle, how many baths did it take to sell? You, I heard you say you sold about 700 of these. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. It went how- instantly. Really? Like very fast. So you put a cap on it. You already you knew that it was going to be 700. I you... didn't know how many people were going to buy it, but mm-hmm. I only made a certain amount. And I didn't expect it to sell out within the first day. So that it was crazy. 700 units. Uh, how many baths is that? It was around six to seven. Because like I didn't do, like, I, I you know, I did it. I it and then I would think like, yeah, I'm getting cold because the bath is like that thing so then I would do th- another one and I'd go in again oh, you were scooping it out whilst you were still in the bath yeah yeah so yeah. some of that water is more like... used than yeah. others Ooh. yeah that's un- unreal again I've got to give it to you that, that is in- in- incredible PR are you a bath person anyway or, or are you a shower person I enjoy baths more but I take more showers do you yeah more efficient I think yeah and, and pro- I, I imagine you're a busy person so baths are obviously a longer process I love a bath I'm a sucker for a bath I'll have I'll try if I can if I'm not in London I'll try and have a bath every day is that is that weird or is that um I think that's really nice yeah <laughs> really nice <laughs> yeah, but if you actually uploaded you wouldn't be able to yeah so. yeah if i actually did work i wonder how much i could how much were these going for <laughs> you're not thinking of selling it on already no, no 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 how much did you sell these for uh 35 for how how much do you reckon i could get for my chatmate bath water I d- oh it depends how many are you doing because you know the less you do the more it is right it's like supreme right it's like you do x amount price at high limited edition i'll, I'll have one bath one uh, bath. yeah and I, okay. so i'll do about a hundred okay hmm. what's my price point i'm getting tips here from bell delphine 40 40 on, you, you think i can sell my bath water more than bell delphine only a hundred available ever don't do it again yeah and So so are you never going to do this again? I don't know. Because, like, I feel like it's been and done. And if I do it again, I don't want to come across like, oh, she's just, you know, lapping it up. She's Mm -hmm. just, you know, trying to get back and roll herself back up. But Mm -hmm. I like the fact that it's limited edition and that it happened once and never again. And if you've got it, you've got it. If you don't have it, you will never have it. Yeah, no, I've got it. Thank you so much. I feel like I'm part of the the club. (laughs) Why bathwater? Because... Why didn't you just sell a T-shirt? Because <laughs> <laughs> no, no one's done it. I've never heard about it before. No. I think it's uh, cool. And I, I thought of the packaging and I thought it was cute. And I like, I've seen worn underwear before and that's a little bit like risque. But this is like PG, but also is in like the realm of sex. Yeah, you know? uh, I see what you mean. And that leads me on to my next question. How It'd be impossible for you to guess this, but... How many people do you think are buying it for the meme culture? And how many people do you think are buying it as like a sexual thing? Ooh, 90% meme, 10% maybe sexual. It's hard to say, Mm. but I know there was a lot of memes going about it. Mm -hmm. But I also reckon some people might, you know, because it's like an intimate thing, right? Like like what, Belle? What what would they they do? I'm trying to figure out how this is sexual in any... Well, I was thinking about it this in the other bath? day because I did sell panties, one off, just my only fans didn't really advertise it much. Mm-hmm. And I was thinking to myself, I was like, what, you know, why? Why would people buy this? I mean, mm-hmm. this isn't like a meme. So why are people wanting to buy it? And I just guess because it's like the closest you can be to someone, you can almost touch it and you can like <laughs> smell it. <laughs> you know? it's, it's just a fetish thing, isn't it? it? Yeah, it's like um, an mm. intimacy thing with out being intimate because you know a poster hasn't you know touched me i've just signed it mm-hmm. but that has maybe been around me you know so, uh, okay uh, I, th- I i i think i get what you mean yeah uh <laughs> and how much do you reckon i could get for this if i i'm not going to but if i put it on now <laughs> so no you have to check ebay because i know oh, some there's someone like, on ebay yeah i think so yeah oh well i'm not going to i think that's that's priceless to me so <laughs> thank you again now you were talking about it being a very intimate thing. This leads me on to the next rumour. Did you give somebody herpes? No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know where that rumour came from, but 
No, I think it's just like, you know, when the internet comes up with stories and they want more from it and the bathwater went like so big. So they wanted like, I mean, someone apparently went to hospital for it. I saw that as well. Do you uh, believe it? Do I believe it? Yeah. No, I, you... I, I, I know what this water is. It's just my bathwater. Yeah. I mean, if it can kill you, then, uh, you know, I'm a genetic, like, <laughs> I've got something genetically wrong with me. <laughs> <laughs>